All right, so these keycaps we're gonna take a look at here today have me so stinking excited. I've been itching to get to this video so I can share these caps with you guys. And there's a few reasons for that. Number one is the price point on these caps. They're 59 to 69 bucks pending uh, profile and then color. Number two is they're readily available. No pre-orders, no group buys, no waiting, right? Right on Amazon, bam check out and they're going to be at your doorstep right there right number three is the keycaps that we're going to take a look at here they will fit any board variations a full size a 65 percent gmmk pro with little tiny shift different space bars your different function it has every keycap you're going to need for any any keyboard right there and they have me really excited now when we're going to look at these keycaps some of the uh upper crust of the keyboard community, right? Yeah, 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 right? Some of these styles are gonna be copies of some of the other higher end keycaps that cost like a hundred and something bucks. You gotta get on a group buy and wait six months to get them. I'm sorry, that's not my game, right? I have never and I never will spend a hundred bucks for a set of keycaps, you know what I mean? Above a hundred bucks for a set of keycaps. That's crazy, you know? And plus I don't wanna wait for them, you know? And that's what makes me excited here is getting such a quality product in every consumer's hand hey sign me up all day long and let's check these out right here let me tell you what they are sweet as you can see they're all by echo here and again multiple color variations and then in profiles as you see we got cherry profile right here in this uh what do they call this color here this is neon with the purple and we'll open all these up and take a look at them and then we have this blue we have this pink with the sa profile orange and gray and then it's like purple and green. And then this one, the LA Dodgers, which is like yellow and purple. So let's go on and scooch these over and we'll just go on and crack this open and take a look. And I do have these on some boards, so we'll take a look at them as well. But again, just straight out the box, look at this case you have here, right? Like that is no joke. And it comes in, again, this nice hard cardboard display case. Wow, wow. Oh, geez, I can't even get it open. Here we go. All right, so here's our keycaps. Like, just look at this, guys. So you got the multiple size space bars, uh, multiple colors. You want to go with the purple space bar, and then your uh, shortcuts, your purple arrows or yellow arrows, enough for a full-size board. Like, must I say anything else? Again, double shot PBT. Look at these bad boys. Can we get some focus on that? Like, just look at that. These are some solid, stinking keycaps. And by the way, when you're looking at the, you're thinking of SA Profile, Sometimes they aren't usable because they're gigantic. They're really big. Like I have some on some boards and I, I can pretty much type on it, but I can't game on it. I really love uh, this profile. This SA profile, it's a little bit lower right there. It's definitely manageable for typing or gaming. But again, just, wow, they're solid. They look good. And again, the price is right. And the storage case, like you can't stinking beat that. Which color are we going to look at next here? Let's go and look at this purple set. This is called... Eva 01 theme. Let's see. Oh, those are gorgeous. This is also the SA profile, right? So again, you got multiple variations you can go with, just like your basic right here, which would be green and purple, or you can come over here and get splash little orange in there with your shortcuts, maybe a function, space bar, and then your arrows. It's Again, you get to play with it in here. They got multiple variations you can set up. Again, these are the exact same profile as the Dodger one we just looked at. And as you can see, very thick double shot keycaps. And I love how they just sit in here. So whenever you're storing them, they're not just in a baggie or something, clanking into each other. They're just, I mean, look at that. Golly, awesome, awesome. All right, let's go look at a these blue guys right here. This is called Macau. So these guys are blue. You know what? Okay, there we go. I got two sets on a board. So those are where we're gonna look at those. But these guys are like, Blue and let me get one of these out. Oh, they're in there good. They're in there good. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. Let's see if we can get some focus right here. So, as you can see, they're kind of blue and then they got that light blue right on the top, as you can see, which is the double shot there. Now, this is a cherry profile, kind of more or less like it's not really low cherry profile like I've seen in some caps. This feels more or less, I mean, they are low. So, they are the cherry profile for sure, but they're a little bit higher than some of the cherries I've used maybe right in between a cherry and then a regular, you know? But again, so cool is you got the yellow accents, spice it up with some yellow arrows or a space and some shortcuts. It would just, I mean, wow, stinking all. And by the way, you do get a keycap over here too, a wire one. So you're not gonna scratch, scratch your uh, keycaps. That does tend to fall out of the case over here though. So anyways, let's close that up. I believe we have one more color 
to look at here, which is going to be the Carbon Retro. And I really like this set. Again, this is the orange and gray. This is also SA, so it's retro. As you can see, so my table is white just for reference right there. You can see these kind of got that retro ivory color. Again, SA profile right there, but not gigantic. They don't they definitely game and type with these. I just, I can't get over it. Like just, just for example, like if you were on your board, say you went with like the orange space bar, right? Came over here, put in your orange uh, backspace, which would actually be up there. You know what I mean? So you just see, you just got a whole different Bam, variation there. Bam, variation there with the orange. You can definitely play with them and tweak them up, which is so stinking awesome. It's just, wow. All right, so the next two sets I wanna show you here are just, again, they're just awesome. They're vibrant. We have a Maya Pro of our Miller Maya Pro. Y'all know my favorite board, right? And these have the Neon Cherry profile on it. Over here, we have the newly released Glorious GMMK with this pink and gray. Well, it's called black and pink over here, you know? So it's kind of got like that red shirt just I don't know, it just looks so cool. And again, you can tweak it as I talked about. If you look at this one, I have that pink space bar and then the pink accents right there with the arrows. Again, you got the multiple different colors, variations if you wanna switch it up right in there, you know, but it's so cool. So let's pop it open and I'll show you what other caps you have. Oh, so there we go. We got the GMMK Pro all set up and we have all these other caps still to play with. If you wanna go with the gray space bar, you can do it. Want black functions, you can do it and take remove all of the pink if you want, except the accents on the keycaps right there. But it's so cool being able to really play with them and just, again, create it to your liking. And as you can see, such nice keycaps right there. Nice font, very clean. You can kind of get a vibe of the SA profile like that, right? Golly, this, this one looks so cool on GMK Pro. Now coming over here to the Maya Pro, Again, these are the neon ones. Look at that. That just looks so good on the black right there. I love how you just got, you got the pink, purple, then the blue on purple right there. Again, very thick. It's just so nice, like, wow. And again, talking Maya Pro, how it fits there. You got your shortcuts and everything. There's not many different keycaps you need on the Maya Pro. I'm popping this one open. We'll see what keycaps we got left over. As you see, we got quite a few over through here, right? But we can go purple space bar if we want, remove all this pink because we got the other arrows. So if you don't want any of the pink at all, you can do that as well. Again, it's so cool. You got like two different variations. With, I know I've said it multiple times, but it just makes me happy. So as you saw right there, whenever we looked over these keycaps, I mean, they are just, they're solid, right? The variations and the options you have with them, they're built great. The price is right for everything that you're getting with that case. And then again, the multiple uh, setups you can get right there. Then again, just the straight up quality. And like I stated in the beginning, some of the people in the keyboard community, which is, uh, can get a, it's a weird community, you know what I mean? And I don't consider myself part of it. I'm a keyboard hobbyist, as I said, not a keyboard enthusiast. You know what I mean? And, and this, as a hobbyist, someone that likes to dab with a few different things right here, I love these. These are fantastic. Why go spend $150, 200 bucks on a set of keycaps, wait six months when you get this right here, which is heck just as stinking good, right? It's probably gonna sit on a shelf. More than likely, you're gonna swap them out in another three months anyways. So, so let's get all that high pouting snooty stuff out of here. You know what I mean? We have great options right here and I highly recommend all of these keycaps. I can't wait till they come out with more colors because again, I'm gonna use these on many of my boards. So all in all, I just wanted to show you guys this awesome product here. Again, it just had me so excited. I hope I helped you out if you were looking to hook up your keyboard or heck, look for some sweet keycaps. Again, these guys take the cake right here. Highly recommend them, right? All the links right down in the description if you wanna scoop up a set. But again, all in all, I hope you enjoyed the video and I was able to help you out. If it was, hit that thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to some future tech videos. And I hope to catch you in the next one. Bye now.